It's a movement, man. It's the shift. I can feel it coming. Some call it the Great Awakening. Where we go one, we go all. QAnon is the people that believe in what Trump's trying to do to change our country. That is a generalization. Well, I've been following all the posts since uh, October 28th. On the internet, from QAnon. Right, started on. It's an entity of 10 or less people okay, that have... Um, uh, Bob the high, high um, clearance, you know, security clearance. Hello. We've all been uh, gathering online and talking together as as Americans and uniting and... Do you think it's a maybe just to make you comfortable talking with other frustrated, sometimes yes. angry people? Yes. Maybe it's not true because there's no evidence of it. It's just stuff being talked about on the internet, right? There hasn't been any non-evidence yet. You guys are you believe in the First Amendment? Oh, I totally believe in the First Amendment. Well, you don't. Know, you're just at the press well, of the you guys are totally weaponized by the CIA. What, what is that? You guys are I don't know anybody in the CIA except a couple of people I've interviewed over the years. Okay. But weaponized, what does that even mean? Like you say stuff that doesn't even mean anything. Um, the term by the CIA. conspiracy theorists, the, the term... Do you think I'm weaponized by the CIA? Maybe not to your knowledge, and it's, that's really, that's unfortunate. You believe there is a deep state? Yes. And what do you think that deep state's doing? Do you think they're running this country? I think they were, and they're petrified now. Right. Because they're losing their control. Donald Trump is right. Yeah, but he's having some fight again. I mean, he said he could do it all himself. I don't think it would be so easy when he came to office. Do you think he's fighting with the deep state a year and a half into his term? I think he's been fighting since before he was elected. He's in this deep state. Do you want to be there? Oh, I definitely believe that like, the Clintons, the Bushes, the Obamas. Do you think the Clintons, the Bushes, and the Obamas are running this country as you stand here in the rain? No, they're trying. The anonymous Q is a hero to many. One man actually hoping to communicate with you by looking straight into our camera. Is it possible you're believing bogus information, yes or no? Is it possible that I'm believing bogus information? No. I mean, let's see. Let's see, Q. Let's see. You have repeatedly we criticized the, the vice president for not specifically calling out Antifa and other left-wing to bring the screws. But are you willing tonight to condemn white supremacists and militia groups and to say that they need to stand down and not add to the violence in a number of these cities as we saw in Kenosha and as we've seen in Portland. Are you prepared to do this? Do it. Well, I, would say, to. I would say almost everything I see is from the left wing, not from the right wing. So what are you, what are you, what are you saying? I'm, I'm willing to do anything I want to see well, Then do it, sir. Say it. Do it. Say it. You want to call them? What do you want to call him? Give me a name. Give me a name. White supremacist and right like me to condemn White proud 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 and right proud 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 boys, Stand back and stand by. But I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Somebody's got to do something about Antifa and the left because this is not a right his wing own, problem. This is, this is a left wing. This is a left wing problem. White supremacist. Antifa is an idea, not an organization. Oh, you got it. Not malicious. That's what his FBI, his FBI director said.